Hello everyone, this is Al Kabir, the analyst, and today I want to talk about Jalen Rager almost being traded to the Ravens, and also I want to talk about the alleged leak schedule, and let's go over some games. This is Al Kabir, the analyst. Well, let's get into it. Jalen Rager. Jalen Rager was almost traded to the Ravens. I seen on Twitter, uh, multiple news reporters reporting this. I think it came from Adam Kaplan first. It's that, yeah, Eagles and Ravens were in trade talks to get Chuck Clark, and we was going to trade Jalen Rager to the Ravens. That made sense. At the draft at Kyle Hamilton, somebody's going to get left out. They saw Marcus Williams. So they pretty stacked that safety. And Chuck is a guy that can play. Chuck Clark can definitely play. Only makes sense. We said Rager there. Maybe he could re-ramp his career with the Ravens. The Ravens don't really have any receivers at all. Uh, they still try to get receivers. So it would have made sense. Um, will Rager fit in that office? I'm really not sure. I know for us and the Ravens, that would have made sense because while receiver market is washed up, it's done up. Ain't really no receivers out there. With us, the safety position is pretty much done. Ain't really no safeties out there. So it would have made sense for this trade to go down. It also explains Jalen Rager's behavior. You know, the players obviously know what happens behind the scenes before us. So it makes sense why he'll wipe out his social media with Eagle stuff. But now that the trade talks had died down, he started to post Eagle stuff again. So it only makes sense. I believe this rumor is very, very true. And that's just based off of Jalen Rager's behavior. Now you see what the rumors about Jalen Hurts. He did delete Eagle stuff. He did stop talking about the Eagles. He continued to talk about the Eagles. And that's why it made you think, like, maybe the rumors of Russell Wilson, Deshaun Watson, getting a quarterback out the draft is probably untrue because Jalen Hurst is not budget. Rager did. Rager probably really believed he was going to be a Baltimore Raven, but tree talks died down. Not sure what happened. Maybe they uh, promised Chuck Clark something. Maybe they, maybe the Eagles promised Rager something. Maybe the reassurance of Rager is what Howie Roseman is like. Look, he's a wide receiver. He's here. He's an Eagle. Maybe Rager felt more confident of keeping his Eagle stuff up. Now, uh, I want to talk about this leak schedule, right? Let me bring it up here. Um, look, man. The only games I can confirm is Detroit. I can confirm that. I can confirm uh, the Cowboys game. Definitely can confirm that. Can confirm the Monday night game against the Minnesota Vikings. And I can confirm that Chicago game because I believe their schedule already came out. But play it. Oh, Dallas Cowboys on Christmas Eve, which I believe is a Saturday. It's going to be one hell of a game. It's going to be one hell of a game is because that could come down to the division. That could come down to a playoff spot. That could come down to a lot of things. And it'll be us versus the Cowboys on Christmas Eve. That will be great. That will be a great game to watch. It will be a very entertaining game to watch. So, um, I can't wait to play them. And we're going to play them at Jerry World. Imagine if it's for the division. Maybe both of us are possibly going to the playoffs. Imagine if it's for the division and we beat them at Jerry World. Lovely. Because even last year's schedule, it came down for us to get into the playoffs. Those last couple games, that's why when we lost to the Giants, I'm like, maybe it's over. But then you beat the Saints. You, you beat other teams to get in. I think that game is going to come down to that. But these other games, I really don't know. I really can't confirm. Pittsburgh, Houston, and things like that. Green Bay. But if that's true, that stretch is pretty strong. After Washington, you got Indy, Green Bay, Tennessee. Oh, Giants is uh. But Chicago is uh. But then you got Dallas. Oh, uh, I believe that's the Saints. So they going to want to get their get back. So it's going to be... 
a very first stretch down the season. But the only three games I can really confirm is Detroit, the uh, Minnesota Vikings, I'm sorry, Chicago, and the Dallas Cowboys. Those are the four games I can confirm. Not really sure how true the schedule is. But, hey, man, what do you think and how do you feel about Jalen Rager was almost traded to the Ravens? He was almost traded. How do you feel about the schedule up here? Oh, pretty favorable. Especially the first half of the season. Got to at least some, you could be three and one. You play Arizona week five. Maybe they don't have the show. I mean, they're not going to have DeAndre Hopkins. So we'll see how true the schedule is. The schedule come out later. And if it is different, I will make a video later today. But this is Al Camille, the analyst. Ghost.